thunderstorms can happen any time of the year here in North Georgia, but severe thunderstorms particularly we want to focus on this week because these can pose some significant risks, especially if you're outside in the spring and summer. So severe thunderstorms are defined by one of two criteria. You can either have both of these or just one of them for a severe thunderstorm warning to be issued. Either winds of 58 miles per hour or greater or hail that is at least the size of a quarter, which in diameter is an inch across. And we can see hail that gets much larger than that as well. But what's important to note about severe thunderstorms is that they can cause just as much, if not more damage than some tornadoes. So you should still be taking these extremely seriously if a severe thunderstorm warning is issued for your area. And we like to give you a heads up about when we could see thunderstorms in our future. And one way we do those is with these thunderstorm outlooks that will show you oftentimes in the spring, summer, and even in the fall time. Here's an example of what one of the thunderstorm outlooks looked like over the weekend. And you notice here we have this light green shading on the map, which means thunderstorms are possible. But sometimes we show you these maps when we see yellow, orange, pink, or even red colors showing up on the map. And those are different categories. I want you to think of this like a scale from one to five, where one is the lowest and five is the highest. But anytime we see a number on that scale, it means that severe thunderstorms are possible. So the Storm Prediction Center puts these outlooks out each and every day. A marginal risk or one out of five for the category means that isolated severe thunderstorms are possible. When we have a slight risk, which is yellow on the map, that means that scattered severe storms are possible and a couple of these storms could end up being more intense. But when we get up to the enhanced risk and especially the moderate or high risk, this means that it's a significant weather day here across North Georgia with the potential for widespread severe weather and particularly intense. When we get into that moderate and high risk categories, that normally means that we especially have a high risk of tornadoes here across North Georgia. But it's important to talk about when we get into those severe weather days, when do you know that you need to take action? Do you know when you need to take shelter from storms moving in? And this comes down to when we have a watch versus a warning in the area. A watch, specifically severe thunderstorm watches, means that we have the conditions present in the atmosphere to where severe storms could develop. This is when you need to have your plan in place just in case a storm threatens your house. When a severe thunderstorm warning is issued, this means that severe thunderstorm is either occurring already, it is imminent, or it is likely. This is when you take that plan and put it into action. You take shelter inside, away from windows, from the thunderstorms moving through. Again, thunderstorms can cause more damage than tornadoes, and they can affect more widespread areas than tornadoes as well, so you need to take them safely heading through this spring.